three people on. Hey, what's going on, guys? My name's Trevor. Welcome back to the r YouTube channel. <clears throat> this morning, I am uh, I'm actually really, really struggling. And it's too dark to put you guys to, to see me. So I'm just gonna show you guys the road while I sit here and talk. I'm actually getting ready for cars and coffee. But, man, I'm, I'm struggling today. I woke up, you know, I made made my bed, I prayed, I got in the shower, and I cried. Now, Trevor, why are you crying on Cars and Coffee Day? Bro, this is your thing. Well, I'll tell you why. And, and honestly, my heart's really broken. But I know, I know that God has a plan. I know that he's gonna make things better. But I'm just, the boys went to their moms this weekend and today is also Cohen's first soccer game, which I wasn't gonna be able to make because of cars and coffee. Well, now he's not even gonna go. He's not even gonna make it because they decide she decided to take him out of town and just completely ignoring me. So I mean I've got I've got his stuff here with me, but it, oh, it hurts. It hurts. there really isn't much that I can do about it the best thing that I can do about it is to pray about it and so I was crying in the shower that's exactly what I was doing exactly what I was doing oh yeah, I kind of just missed my turn that's all right <laughs> there's another turn up here head we can take a little detour never hurt <clears throat> sometimes we're on here on our social media and everything and everything is looking beautiful and great and I try my best I try my best to not have to not struggle but you know what struggling builds us it makes us stronger God put it in our path because he knows we can get past it <clears throat> he knows that once we're past it we will have learned something and be stronger because of it. Otherwise, he wouldn't put it in our path. And so I've, I've continually got to remind myself to keep waiting in his presence. Keep waiting in his presence. Because in his hands, his will would be done. And we won't. I won't make a mistake by trying to handle it myself. Now, I might still make a mistake, but you know what? If I put it in his hands, I can I can feel a lot better. I trust that everything's going to be all right one way or another. Now, I'm just, I'm struggling today, guys. I'm struggling this morning. Not gonna lie, feeling lonely last night, and, and it's crazy because you know I, I mean I got home at ten, so I had a, I had a pretty busy night, pretty good night hanging out with my uncle, and and then I get home and it just, it just hits you like a ton of bricks. It just hits you that the three little boys aren't running around. 
it's hard. It's really hard. Pair was swinging by the old house. I'm not really actually stopping or anything. I'm just driving by. <coughs> Because Dylan's is right over here where I missed my turn earlier. So, I just wanted you guys to know that you're not alone in your struggles. I'm not alone in my struggles. We all have different struggles, but we can all relate. And no struggle is greater or lesser than somebody else's they're all equally the same and that's the way you got to look at it because because I don't know what you've been through and you don't know quite all that I've been through so it you just got to you got to I don't I don't know what I'm trying to try and get here but I don't know what I'm trying to say there but you just got to take everybody's struggle like it's your biggest struggle because that could very well be their biggest struggle. That could be my biggest struggle. I'll tell you right now, my boys definitely, definitely my hardest lessons to learn to go through. But they're so worth it. They're so worth it. I wouldn't ask for it any other way, honestly. Because if, if it wouldn't have been the way it is right now, I wouldn't be the man that I am today. I have no doubts about that. I would not be the man that I am today without all of my struggles. So anyhow, if you guys ever, ever feel lonely, ever need somebody to just talk to, if you're feeling suicidal, send me a message. If you're feeling low, shoot me a message. Because you know what? that little message from you it, it's gonna cheer me up it's gonna cheer me up but at the same time God's gonna work his words through me to reach you and bring you up too and it's gonna be an amazing amazing feeling you're gonna feel the Holy Spirit flow through you whether you know it or not that's what you're gonna be feeling and it's incredible so now I'm here at Dylan's. Gonna get these donuts and head over to Cars and Coffee. Even though today I'm struggling, I'm still gonna get it. So go out there, have a great day. Look at the little positives. Look at the little positives that you can find and focus on those. Don't focus on the struggle. Focus on the good because it's there. God bless y'all, I love y'all, and we'll catch y'all in the next video. Have a great night, great night, great day, <laughs> great evening, whichever it is that you're watching.